Welcome back, everybody. It is right now, 20 minutes before noon. And you know what? We all know that wonderful work the Make-A-Wish Foundation does for communities. And it takes a lot of hard work and money, though, to grant those wonderful wishes to those folks who deserve them so much. Joining me right now, we have Lane Carr and Trevor Trainer, And we're going to talk about a very special fundraising event happening tomorrow that you can actually be part of. And hey, you know what? Not only do you get to come and help raise money for this worthy cause, you get to drive away with a clean car so tell us more we are so excited to be able to partner with make a wish mm -hmm. um tidal wave it's charity day for us right. tomorrow it's our 16th year we've raised over 1.3 million dollars for everyone and you get to come out get your car washed we're going to have some giveaways we've got uh we're going to be selling food we have a one of their fundraisers that hikes with her dog mm -hmm. and she's going to be there signing autographs and letting you take pictures uh and it's just a great day so, so, and this is, is this at all Tidal Wave locations or just the Harvest location? It is at all Tidal Wave locations. Each one gets to pick their own charity, and so wow. we chose Make-A-Wish. I love that. That is, that's just wonderful. So, so we know Make-A-Wish benefits from this overall, but kind of, if you don't mind, give me a little bit of an idea of where that money goes and how Make-A-Wish will put that money sure. to use. Sure. So, uh, Make-A-Wish's uh, mission is very simple. Uh, we seek to grant the wishes of critical children right here in Alabama. Uh, and we do so. Luckily, we have community partners who are, are generous enough to uh, set up these fund fundraisers and stuff for us. But uh, the money goes to all sorts of things. It goes to granting wishes and trips to Disney, or we've had puppy wishes where a, a oh. young child may want a puppy. Uh, we've even had a young lady over in uh, the Shoals area who wished to have braces a few years ago. It, be, it really can be a, a humbling experience to see what these children wish for. Isn't that amazing? I would have never thought that would have been somebody's wish. So that, that is very humbling to hear about. So, so as far as the car wash itself, how does this work? Do you just pull up and drive through or with all this activity in the parking lot, is there a special process and how do you give? You just come on in every wash that is sold uh, from open to close that day is donated to charity uh, the, all the proceeds go to charity any money that's raised on the site from us helping you dry your cars from buying a um, a burger or we have like I said we have raffles we have uh, artwork we have some gift baskets any money that's raised that day but just come on in wash your car and then we'll take it from there and just empty your pockets and the bottom line is this is again let's run through it happening at the harvest location of Tidal Waves yes. Car Wash. Yes, we're on Highway 53 in Harvest, right by Jeff Road. Uh, it is from 8 a.m. until 9 p.m. And once again, anything that you come through and purchase or donate goes directly to the charity so that we can help them grant the wishes of the children that are waiting. Well, I think I speak for everybody in our community when I say thank you for your passion for our community, your compassion for these people who deserve these wonderful wishes and for joining forces to make this happen for these folks. Thank you we so sure much for having us. It. Thanks, Chris. And we'll be right back.